Hello everybody. In this video, I'm going to be showcasing one of the new units in Anime Last Stand, Light Admiral or Sengoku. This unit is part of the Raid Part 2 update, and you can get them from Act 5 or Act 6 raids of Marine Fort. To evolve them, you're going to need a bird and him, and then 40 spirit shards. The bird you can get from Act 4 or Act 5 in Marine Fort raids, and I don't know the exact chance on these, but you can see I got a double. So yeah, I think it's pretty easy to get them. Just farm raids like you've been doing probably. But yeah. I'm going to showcase the unit. I do have Shinigami on him. But yeah, let's get into a showcase. Hope you enjoy. Okay, I'm here in a Planet Namek Nightmare Infinite to take a look at Light Admiral Evo, otherwise known as Sengoku, I think, from One Piece. So let's take a look at this unit. He's going to cost 5.5k to place. Not a problem. I farmed up plenty. And on placement, wow, we can see his Buddha coming in. Buddha statue. I think that's a Buddha of some sort. Um, okay, pretty cool. He's doing 29.7k every 6.75 seconds with 16.5 range. Keep in mind, I do have Shinigami on mine, so it does have these bonuses on screen here. So, yeah, this is a level 1 no skill tree showcase, though, and these are still impressive stats for a level 1 unit. Let's go ahead and keep upgrading them here. Boom, boom. Okay, upgrade 3, he's gonna get a new attack, Holy Beam. It costs 6k, let's go ahead and take a look at that. So he is a cone AoE, what was the upplacement cone? He was a line before. Okay, so he went from line AoE to cone AoE. And he's doing 52.3k every 7.65 seconds with 25.3 range. He is hybrid. I didn't pay attention. Is he hybrid on placement? He is. He's hybrid on placement. Okay. And he is now a cone AoE. Uh, can we see if he's a multi-hit? It looks like it, yes. So he is a multi-hit, which is good because if you didn't know, they kind of buffed multi-hit units with the new update. Alright, let's keep upgrading him here. Upgrade 7, he's going to get Divine Flash, so that's going to cost us 11.5k, 96.4k every 6.75 seconds, with 25.3 range. He's still doing pretty good for a level 1 unit, pretty impressive. He's going to get Divine Flash here, new attack. Alright, looks like he is now a Circle AoE, a pretty large circle though, and he's doing 118k every 7.65 seconds, 29.7 range. He is still hybrid, let's go ahead and take a look if he has a passive. He does, he has cripple, okay, what that's gonna do is it's gonna slow down enemies and make him take more damage. Very good support passive. Let's go ahead and max him out here. And we're looking at nearly 200k every 7.65 seconds with 33 range, so exact 177k. Which is not bad for a hybrid unit. Uh, he's not too expensive, he's mostly expensive to place down, but his upgrades aren't too bad. Yeah, the highest it gets up to is 15k. So, let's see how many you can place of him. Three. Three. Okay, so you can place up to three Sengoku's, by the way, there's that glitch. Uh, and he actually has very nice stats. He's pretty cheap, except for placing down. And uh, very nice support, I'd say. Well, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, maybe consider subscribing, because I upload content pretty similar to this almost every day. But yeah, thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed, hope to see you in the next one, and have a great day.